And you know, the irony is, Nancy, you were a strong, confident woman who could handle anything because what you were handling is beyond what most women will ever even imagine carrying, not even for a week, a month, or a year, but almost four years straight. And I imagine that um, those layers of what is, what if my daughter finds out this money just keeps evaporating or things keep going wrong and costing more money. Like you could not throw enough money at your problems. That must have compounded the shame. Did it feel to you at any point in that journey that you were being punished for your actions? Yes, constantly, because every time I would try to do the right thing, based on the world's definition of what would be the right thing would be to get out of that and I would try and I would try and I would try and I would work so hard, so, so hard, sometimes carrying two or three different kinds of jobs in order to make it and to get out of this trap. And every time that would fail, it was just done. I was just, it again confirmed my worst fear. I could never be forgiven. I could never walk out of this. I could never survive this. I'm stuck. I have to do this because there's no way that I'm going to be let out by whatever entity that ran the world in my mind at that time. And certainly there was no idea or concept that I could ever, ever um, be given grace or forgiveness or hold my head up and certainly never talk to my daughter about it um, in a loving way and in an appropriate way. And so yes, I felt very punished. It was like, um, like a chokehold around my neck daily.